four-time Olympic biathlon champion Alexander Tikhonov shared his opinion about the trip of figure skating coach Terry Tutbirds to the USA. Tutbirds will come to Boston to his daughter Diana Davis, who is training in the USA in a dance duet with Gleb Smolkin. The director of the skating rink in Norwood, Rebecca Stamp, previously stated that Tutbirds is forbidden to be on the ice or at the side. Terry did not take into account that the Americans adopted the Rachenkov law. All athletes convicted of doping at competitions where American athletes participated are considered a threat to the American population and its interests. Americans are always politically different. But I would have supported them, if not for the former head of our sport Mutko, who promised Rachenkov after the Sochi Olympics almost a beautiful afterlife. Instead of talking to him normally and solving all the issues, he was intimidated and provoked to escape. I saw Rachenkov when he flew out of the Ministry of Sports, he already has a squint, and here in general his eyes looked in different directions. So people involved in athletes who took doping fall under sanctions under the Rachenkov law. Probably, the Americans are not fools, although I treat them extremely negatively, especially the leadership led by the Paralympian Biden. Over the past eight years, I would have gathered fraternal countries around me and spent all my efforts on it so as not to grab my head later when yachts and mansions began to be arrested and eight former deputy prime ministers fled the country. But Atari does not care deeply about this or there is ignorance of the issue and therefore she behaves rudely. I heard from one of the leaders how Tutbirds threatened to destroy him. But the stars burn and do not go out only in the sky. I have walked this path myself and have always remembered that it is necessary to serve the people, not a single individual. Terry, you are not yet a Beatle, not Tchaikovsky, not Moskvina, not Miss Hin and not Tarasova, who made an era and won everything. May God grant you to stand in this row. But the great river always flows quietly, Tikhonov said.